morning welcome back to the channel so let's talk about the best two baits for the month of august so far on our guide trips we've been fishing ultra shallow water that's crystal clear so our top two baits have been a prop bait and a fluke so let's dive in and talk about these two baits okay so since we're fishing this real shallow water and in florida shallow water typically is clean and very grassy not a lot of baits will come through that stuff clean. So you really are limited in what you can throw. Your topwater lures, your frogs obviously, uh, and your weightless lures. Your swimming worm is always going to be an option in Florida. But basically the two that are dominating right now is your topwater propeller style bait and your typical OG fluke. Now let's get into why these lures are so effective. Now if you like these type of videos and you enjoy this content, do us a favor, hit that subscribe button. Also, please like and comment below. What do you like to see in these type of videos? What do you want to learn more about? We do our best to provide tips and tricks for all of you guys coming to Florida Lakes so that way your experience when you come down is a lot more productive. Okay, so let's talk about the propella lures. These are top water surface lures, just like the OG Devil's Horse. Now, Devil's Horse is still part of my arsenal, but there are a lot of new brands out there that just have better finishes, just like Berkeley's Spin Rocket or the Rapala Prop X. These prop baits have a propeller in the front and in the back. And the higher end baits will usually put a little feather treble in the back and they usually have real sticky sharp hooks. Now what makes a prop style lure so effective? It's a very subtle top water lure. When you pop it, it will want to just hover there and sit still. And the little propellers will kind of wiggle. And that little stinger feather treble will just waver back there, real tantalizing to those fish. A lot of these strikes will come when the bait is just sitting still. You'll pop it, and as it's sitting there and the ripples are fading, you'll see a weight come. And in that ultra shallow water, the bass have to push that water because they're up high on the surface. They'll come up underneath the bait. If they don't strike it right away, they'll come up, up underneath the bait and just wait. And you'll know they're there because there'll be a bulge in the water around the bait. All of a sudden, you'll pop the lure one time and boom, they'll take it. That's one of the most aggressive strikes in shallow water that you can ever have. That subtle action in Florida grass in that ultra shallow water is hard to beat for a solid bite, especially a big fish this time of year. So let's take it to the water. I'll show you how to pop it and you'll see exactly what happens when a fish comes and wakes the bait and strikes it. As you can see, I'm making short twitches of the rod to pop the bait without moving it very much. You need to let the bait sit between pops and oftentimes you will see the fish coming as it wakes the surface on its way to a violent strike. It's working. Now anytime you're in clean, clear water at Soldier Shallow, it's real hard to beat a weightless lure like a Senko or in my case a fluke. I prefer a fluke because you can do more with it than a weightless style so stick on like a Senko. A fluke you can give it that twitch erratic action or you can just pause it and let it sit still and that subtle real neutral effect that that fluke has triggers a lot of strikes and especially from some bigger bass that just won't hit a more aggressive lure. Now I've done a lot of videos on how to fish a fluke. So if you want to learn more about fishing a fluke, hit one of those videos in the link below and you'll see exactly how I like to work them. We're not going to redo a fluke video in this video. So just check those out and get you a fluke to fish shallow. So in the dog days of August, when the fish move shallow, pick up one of these two baits, a prop style topwater lure or your weightless fluke and enjoy more catches on your time on the water. Until next time, tight lines.